Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video, we will see how we can update value in certain column based on given conditions. So I am on my Jupyter notebook and here I am creating a data frame which is holding data from the Titanic data set. So let me quickly run this and show you how the data looks like. So these are the initial 20 rows I have pulled in. And now let's say you want to update the value of the sex column wherein you want to replace male with boys. So let's see how we can achieve that. So first of all, we need to say df and then we can use loc. Inside loc, we need to define data frame with the column which we are looking for. And then you can say what value are you looking for. So you want all the male values to be replaced with boys. So let's see. So this is how you can do it. So this is the column name in which you want to replace this value. So whenever this condition is meeting, you will replace this column with this value. Let's try this out. So you can see that instead of male, we are seeing all the boys. I mean, in the entire data set, we have replaced everything with boys. So whatever we are doing here is just in visual. We are not changing anything in our actual CSV file. Now let's say you want to change some other column. You are comparing this column, but you want to update the value in some other column. So how can we do that? So let's say whenever it is male, now although we have changed it with boys, so let me replace it with boys. So whenever sex is boys, then we can say that replace values and in cabin column by boys cabin let's try this out okay we are uh, i need to go with mail because we didn't save that data set okay so you can see that wherever it is mail now we are changing the cabin value to boys cabin earlier it was some other cabin number so this is how you can change the value now let's say you want to update multiple columns based on a single column. How can you do that? So let me reload this data set. And okay. Now what we will be doing here is we are going to use LOC again. And we'll say that let's set SIB SP and cabin columns to any if person didn't survive. So it means we need to set two columns we need to set values in two columns based on one condition so we will see if survived value of survived column which is like df survived then we'll say if survived equal equal one then we want to replace two columns sib sp And let me put break commas here. And we want to replace Kevin column here with value, let's say NA. I hope I didn't miss any brackets. Okay. And now if I will say DF, you will see that whenever the survive value was 1, you got the SIBSP and Kevin as NA. So all these are the rows. So here it is one. It is like here it was zero. So we didn't do any change here. So let's say it's zero. So we are still retaining. But whenever the survive value is one, we are updating last two columns. Now here we are updating single value to both these columns. What if we want to apply different different values to these two columns? So whenever survived is one, we want SIBSP to be as an A1. And we want cabin value to be an A2. Let's run this up. So you can see that just based on one column, now we are updating two columns with different, different values. So this is how you can change the values based on given condition. I hope you enjoyed watching today's video. Thank you.